there, Ospreys. Welcome to Mallory's Madness. I'm Mallory Eldridge, bringing you another quarter of sports madness. Well, collegiate hockey is getting two new arenas. This month, both UConn and another Connecticut school, Sacred Heart, open new hockey arenas, each spending more than $70 million on the facilities. The ribbon cuttings came the same week as Quinnick PX men's team, another Connecticut, Connecticut school, climbed to the top spot in the national polls. With his shoulder not bothering any, him anymore, Milwaukee Brewers' new acquisition, Brian Anderson, is hoping he can recapture the hitting success he enjoyed earlier in his career. The Brewers announced the signing of Anderson on Monday. The terms of his contract has not been revealed, but a person close to the situation said the former Miami Marlins third baseman and right fielder received a one-year, $3.5 million contract and could earn an additional $2 million in performance bonuses. NASCAR's Rogers Penske is moving closer to winning a Le Mans, the 24-hour race in France. The lure of the Le Mans brought Penske back to sports car racing under the revamped IMSA regulations that have created a top GTP class of cars featuring hybrid engines that will be eligible to compete at the Le Mans in June. Last year was a pretty big year for Penske as two of his team's drivers won the top two North American racing series in the same season. Although winning the Le Mans has been on his bucket list for years and maybe with his 86th birthday coming around, he can get a last minute gift of the Le Mans win. Well, that's another edition of Mallory's Madness. Thanks for watching. I'm Mallory Aldrich, and I'll see you in next time in the next quarter of Madness.